What's up guys, so I got something to say and I want you guys to take these next few moments and listen to every word that I speak because it's coming from the bottom of my heart and it's, in my opinion, the truth. So take it all in, sit back, just watch and I hope you, I hope you guys get something from this. So one day each and every one of us will die. Yeah, it's kind of crazy to say but we're going to die. Everyone watching this video, you're going to die. I'm going to die. But guess what, guys? We were put on this earth by the big man up top with a purpose. We all have a purpose that he wants us to serve. Whether we know what that purpose is or not, we, we still have one. But once that purpose is fulfilled, he may decide to take our lives, guys. I know it's kind of kind of weird to say that, but... Our lives may come to end once that purpose is fulfilled. I mean, it's, it's what it is. I mean, but we can sit around fearing death or we can embrace the time and the life that we have on this earth. Why, why it's here, why it's right in front of us. Life is no short and there's, there's no time to live life with no meaning. Live a life full of dreams and make something yourself. Start making history. Instead of saying, I want to be Steve Jobs, I want to be Elvis Presley, I want to be this person. Make yourself that person. Make history. Instead of reading about others in history books, make yourself a part of that history book. Become history yourself. You can be remembered for your dedication, your success, your determination, the effort you gave, or we can simply be forgotten. So I'm pretty sure we would rather all be remembered in history rather than forgotten. So start getting to that and fulfilling your purpose that we have on earth. If you died today, would you believe that you served that purpose? Do you think you would be happy if you died right now? Don't be afraid to fail, guys. I know we 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 all think, oh, I'm not gonna fail. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna be at the top. I'm gonna do this without failing. That's not the truth, guys. I mean, I honestly, every one of us are gonna fail. You're gonna fail. I'm gonna fail. Everyone's gonna fail. Steve Jobs failed. That's that's one of my big guys out there. Um, that that I love to follow, and I would always read about and watch all of his videos and everything, and he would motivate me and. I remember watching videos about him and talking about how he failed miserably and look where he got in life. So we're going to fail. For me personally, I've always wanted everyone to like me. I've always wanted everyone to see me as the perfect person and I always wanted to get everything done perfectly the first time but I realized that that's not going to happen guys. We do fail. Um, I knew I was going to make mistakes. I knew I was going to make enemies. but. I also knew that I have that purpose and I knew everything I'm doing in life, everything that's going on in my life is because it's trying to get to that purpose out of me and it's trying to make me fulfill my purpose here on earth. The fear of death and the fear of failure doesn't get to me guys. That's what makes me different. Though That stuff does not get to me. I mean, um, Another question is, how many times have you guys said, I can't, or you've gave up on something in life? How many times? I'm sure we've all said it and all done it hundreds of times, if not thousands of times in our lifetime. All the results in life, in your life, are consequences of the choices that you have made. Your actions are what deliver those results that you have in life. Nobody else decides or controls your life but yourself. So the results that you produced are based on the kind of person you have decided to become. Your choices are what made you who you are. And your choices are what gave you those results whether you like it or not. Um, so are you satisfied with those results? Have you served your purpose, do you think? Do you believe that there's something else for you here on earth? Uh, is there something else that you're supposed to do? I mean, I question that every single day. 
You need to start believing in yourself though and start building yourself and start encouraging yourself. Stop saying I can't, start saying I can because you can. If you put your mind to it, you, you can do it guys. I can't should not be a word and it should not be in our vocabulary anymore. And I'm gonna be honest, I say it and I've been putting my foot down lately and I'm, I'm not saying I can't anymore, I'm saying I can do this. Logan, you can do this. You can do it as long as you set your mind to it and my life is turning out so much better because I'm getting more done, I'm doing more, I'm, I'm happier because I say I can and I, instead of I can't. And back to your purpose, if you don't know what that is, start figuring it out, read up on yourself and start understanding who you are. We're always reading about others, we're always studying about others and reading books about other top famous people or top historic historical characters but um, like I said make yourself history and start reading up on yourself and maybe you can find your your purpose something that's also kind of weird guys is humans are goal oriented you have to decide how you want to live your life start training your brain to live life with one goal which is to fulfill your purpose we put fear in our minds and we put fear in ourselves running through life with confusion not knowing what to do start start inspiring to make a difference in life and to be different yourself make yourself go out and claim success and go out and earn it and work for it nothing really comes easy and that's what I've learned um, Everybody can say it and everybody can tell you guys and I don't know if you'll listen it or understand it But nothing in life comes easy. You have to be able to, to Work for it. You have to be willing to work for it and you have to want it and you have to go out and claim it yourself Nothing is going to be simple. Everything will be difficult Most of our generation in my age and a little bit older than me and younger than me even We're weak guys. I'm gonna be honest. We are weak human beings. We give up the first sign of failure and that's not what should be happening. Those who live life taking risks and not, not giving up at failure are the ones that are coming out in success. You have to be able to understand that you're going to fail and if you want success and you want to be someone that's crazy and you want to, you want to fulfill your purpose, then you have to get over failure. You have to understand that you're going to fail. The ones that fulfill our purpose the right way and get success in the end are the ones that know they failed and they overcame the failure. If you're going to overcome that failure, then you're going to achieve success. Do not listen to that little voice up in your brain that's telling you that you can't do something because you can. It's, it's just in your head. and. We all have that little voice and it's always telling you, oh, you can't do this, you can't do that, but you can as long as you set your mind to it. I strongly believe that. 99% um, of people give up that first sign of failure, but that 1% are the ones that succeed. So are you gonna be that 1% or are you gonna be in the other group, the 99%? It all comes down to not fearing death and trying to live your life and fulfill your purpose that's kind of my rant and that's what i have to say is do you know what your purpose is and are you fulfilling your purpose thanks guys